Well, the Vatican is hosting a conference on preventing child abuse, promoting child safeguarding at the time of COVID-19 and beyond begins tomorrow. It includes lectures and roundtable discussions featuring specialists and church leaders. Joining us now from Rome is Chiara Graffini, coordinator of the project promoting child safeguarding in the time of COVID-19 and beyond. Chiara, thank you for joining us today. Can you tell us more about this project and how many people are participating? And also, what do you hope to accomplish? The project trained 1,084 people in 27 Italian territories, and its association has developed a specific child protection policy for its education action context. And lastly, how is the Vatican involved in this conference? On uh, uh, Thursday, we'll uh, present uh, the research by the uh, Catholic uh, University. Uh, it's an uh, important uh, uh, meeting uh, because uh, discuss uh, about uh, uh, the protection of minor uh, civil and uh, ecclesiastical institution, uh, Cardinal uh, O'Malley for uh, Pontifical Commission uh, Protection of Minors, Monsignor Lorenzo Ghizzoni, Italian uh, Church, uh, European and Italian uh, representative uh, parliament, uh, Honorevole Ronzulli and Honorevole Chinnici, and uh, the uh, Italian uh, police for uh, online safety uh, minors uh, is uh, an important uh, action uh, in Italy, and uh, the Gregorian uh, Center Protection uh, Minor. Uh, this meeting uh, is uh, important uh, because it supports the uh, dicastery for uh, communication and by Pope Francis uh, with uh, uh, Meshan, uh, written by Pope. Well, Chiara, thank you so much for your time and for what you do. Chiara Graffini, coordinator of the project promoting child safeguarding in the time of COVID-19 and beyond. Thank you again.